Peacemaking is hard work. It requires difficult conversations with friends. It's clear that we have to make sure that peace comes not at the expense of any country. The relations that India has had with Ukraine and with Russia, I think, do position Prime Minister Modi, uh, Minister Jai Shankar, and others to play a really critical role. The rule of law does matter, that principles should rule the day. Now, Prime Minister Modi uh, is the only leader, probably, mm. who has visited um, mm -hmm. Russia yeah. and Ukraine, you yep. know, within just a few days sure. of a gap. Uh, already, India is showing keen interest in bringing peace in the region. We've heard Prime Minister Modi mm. say this time and again. Uh, will the U.S. back this initiative? We welcome everyone's cooperation, participation, and peacemaking. Peacemaking is hard work. It requires difficult conversations with friends. I think if you start from the principle that the most important law we have in the world is sovereignty of borders, something India lives with every single day, it's clear that we have to make sure that peace comes not at the expense of any country. So we welcome that participation as long as it abides by those principles of an unwarranted, um, unasked for invasion of a sovereign country across that sovereign border. The relations that India has had with Ukraine and with Russia, I think, do position Prime Minister Modi, uh, Minister Jai Shankar, and others to play a really critical role. Um, and if we keep those principles together, I think we welcome that because there's going to have to be tough conversations with friends. India opens doors, sometimes the U.S. doesn't, and vice versa. U.S. opens doors, sometimes India doesn't. I think of our people, of our security, and our economic growth. So I look forward to this coming year. I think it'll continue to soar. And as we have seen two democracies hold two elections, it shows democracies really are stronger, that the rule of law does matter, that principles should rule the day, and that right makes might, not might makes right.